So today is Sunday, um, the fourth Sunday in for our doing the diet. Um, last couple days I have felt amazing, but today, today I don't feel super awesome. I, I, I'm not in pain. I'm not in pain. Um, but I feel really weak. I feel heavy today. I just, uh, obviously I washed my hair today, Sunday and all. And, uh, it was really difficult to even get through washing my hair. Um, I didn't sleep well at all last night. I kept having kind of nightmares about trying to sleep in a haunted house and how I was going to figure out how to make friends with the ghosts so they would let me sleep and not bother me. <laughs> so really, I just, I did not sleep well at all last night and that probably has something to do with it. But I'm just kind of going through my morning routine like I said, no pain. I just feel really heavy. Um, and possibly maybe I've overdone it the last couple of days. I've been feeling so awesome and just anxious to get back into the swing of things. And um, compared to what I've been doing in the past, I've done a ton and it feels so good. Um, but I'm just going to keep it kind of low key today and um, hopefully this will kind of go away and I'll feel better and uh, definitely going to take a nap and maybe that will help with um, kind of how I'm feeling. So uh, we'll check in later. I have um, something I've been dreaming about for a long time planned for dinner so we'll see how that goes. For lunch what I've made is um, a salad. I have used the just a small portion of the shrimp we have left over since I love that so much. Uh, half of, of an avocado and a couple of leaves I've cut up of the romaine lettuce um, and then just squoze some lime juice on top of that. So something that's pretty light, just kind of more of a snack, but I plan on eating pretty heavy for dinner and um, I'm excited about that. Um, beautiful day out. It actually started out with a thunderstorm last night, and um, I didn't, it didn't really bother me much. I, I woke up just fine, just normal this morning. Maybe feeling a little bit groggy, but that probably just because I was up late. Um, so it's um, almost 4.30 today. Uh, didn't really have a breakfast again. I really haven't been eating a lot of breakfast lately. I've been mostly just having sort of a brunch, um, usually more like around lunchtime. Uh, which was the case today. I just had a couple of eggs and some mushrooms, like it's like my staple brunch item, and uh, a little bit of pesto on that. And then uh, for a snack, I just had uh, some nuts and uh, a couple of little slices of goat of the goat cheddar cheese. All right, for dinner, Josh and I are making fish and chips instead of potatoes. We have got sweet potatoes. I missed cooking over there on parchment paper. Uh, I don't know if we should have put oil on it, but um, gosh, I'll let you know after we try them. As far as the fish, what I've done over here is I've got a halibut from Costco. These are eight ounce portions, so I'm cutting them in half using the same recipe as you can use for artichoke, the, the baked fried artichoke hearts. Um, what page is that on? One, three, 354. I made up one and a half times the solution and then just put the flour, salt, and pepper in here. I've made a couple of them so far and I've got one more to go and then I'll just bake it in the oven. Okay, so here are both ingredients. What I did with this is I just took a little bit of the oil that I had uh, bathed the fish in before flour coating them, put that on, and then there's how the fish has turned out. I'm gonna cook, cook them both for 400 for about 20 minutes and see where we're at. So dinner is ready. Um, this is how everything turned out. I've got a, uh, something set up for lunch for another day, and we'll see how it is to taste. Okay. Yeah, it's really good. I wanted the... Tasha looks happy to be here. <laughs> Those are good. I might have cooked them just to see if to see if they could have got a little browner. 
I ended up cooking them for 25 minutes on 400. How long did you cook the fish? Same. I just got done eating the halibut and actually for not even liking halibut or fish I actually ate the whole thing and thought it was good. Um, so it's a great way to make fish and chips I think. Good job honey. And Josh. Josh good. did the fries. Good job Josh. Mm -hmm. And Tasha will do the cleanup. Good job Tasha. How do you compare it to regular fish and chips? Um. Well, there's not all that fried goodness soaking through. <laughs> and there was no um, tartar sauce. But, I mean, it was good. It definitely was good. It, um, my favorite thing so far, though, has been the shrimp tacos. Yeah, those are good. But tomorrow, I'm going to try and kill it again with another new recipe. So we'll see. Awesome.